Hey guys, what's up? Here is another recent pickups video. Uh, this time I'm going to do my Xbox 360 games. Um, I don't think I ever uh, got around to uh, showing you any of my uh, new ones even back then in my uh, previous videos. Um, so I'm just going to do the whole collection. Um, not that many because I only buy exclusive games on my Xbox, so uh, anyways, here we go. Alright, Left 4 Dead 2. Um, I really like this game. Uh, I haven't played it in forever, but you know, I would just go over to friends' house, friends' houses and like, uh, play this game all night and like watch horror movies and then play this game. You know, when I had like a huge zombie phase, you know, I think everyone did, um, I would just play the crap out of this game. You know, it's Left for Dead, so, you know. Um, okay, this I got from a friend, Stuntman Ignition. I've actually never played it. Um, you know, I've seen people play it, but I've never gotten around to playing it because I'm not really, not really into it, uh, these kind of games. Um, so... Another one I got from a friend was Black Sight Area 51. I have not played this game. I pro I think I know I will not enjoy it, so I just haven't even touched it. Um, Oblivion. Now this is not an exclusive, but I decided to buy it uh, before Skyrim came out. And uh, this was like days before Skyrim came out. And I bought this, and they didn't have it for PS3 at GameStop, so I bought it on Xbox 360. So that's kind of good about having two systems. Is when there's not that multi-platform game on a certain console, you can get it on the other console. So anyways, um, Oblivion's good. I haven't played too much of it, though, because like, a couple days later, Skyrim came out, and I was just like, you know, playing the crap out of Skyrim. So Dragon Age 2, not as good as Dragon Age 1. Still enjoyed it. Um, it is a good game, though. I do like it, but it's not as good as Dragon Age 1. Dragon Age 1 was just, like, the best ever, and then Dragon Age 2 was just kind of like, you know, they changed the art style and everything and the combat, and it was just kind of like, I mean, it's a good game, it's a good story and everything, but it's like, compared to where we thought the series was going, it was kind of a letdown. Um, the Witcher 2, this is the Enhanced Edition. Um, this comes with, like, a little guide, see, of the game. It's kind of like a, it's not like a manual, I mean, it's like a legit guide, game guide, um, for the game. Uh, it doesn't, like, tell you achievements or anything like that, um, of, like, how to get achievements, but it does tell you, um, you know, where to go and how to, like, reach a certain point in the story, how to, you know, like, in this game, you can choose, uh, how do I say this, like, you can choose, um, it does have RPG elements, it actually is an RPG, what am I saying, um, it's like Mass Effect, you choose the ending, okay, pretty much, by how you, uh, go on with certain, uh, quests, or how you talk to certain people, or how you make relationships, so this guide helped me a lot, um, with dealing with like what I wanted to do next if that makes any sense probably not you're like what the fuck did she just say anyways um so moving along Marvel Ultimate Alliance and Forza Motorsport I never played Forza I just played Marvel Ultimate Alliance um good game Fallout 3 love this game played it and beat it I thought it looked so cool the first time I saw it at GameStop and uh, a couple of years ago I picked it up because I needed it because it looks amazing and it is amazing. It looked amazing and it is amazing. Um, yeah, it's Fallout 3 and it's so good. I haven't played New Vegas yet. I know I should, but I haven't. Um, Fable 2, one of my favorite Xbox 360 games. love Fable. Fable 3, huge letdown, but, you know, I stuck with it because I love Fable. 
It wasn't anything like the director of the game said it was going to be. I mean, it's it's not garbage, but it's close. Um, Mass Effect 2. I rented Max Mass Effect 1 when I first got my Xbox 360 and loved it. And I decided to buy Mass Effect 2, beat it, love it. Favorite Xbox 360 series of all time. Now it's on a multi. It's a multi-platform game now, which is weird because it was originally Xbox, and uh, and PC I think, and uh, yeah I just, you know, for the sake of that time it was my favorite on the Xbox 360. Favorite series though probably on the whole generation of co this generation of consoles. Mass Effect Three. Yep, I flipped it to female shepherd side because I am always female shepherd. I'm not male shepherd. Um, awesome game. Loved it. Loved it. The ending was amazing. I know people didn't like the ending, but I did. The endings. Um, Halo Reach. Good Halo game. Uh, Forza Motorsports 3 and Halo 3 ODST. This came with my Xbox. I mainly got it for Halo 3 ODST because I like Halo. And I really did like Halo 3 ODST. And then Halo 3. I think I've showed this in previous videos. <sighs> I love Halo 3. I am getting, um, actually, you know what? Halo 3 is probably my least favorite in the whole entire Halo series. But, uh, I like the Halo stories. And, um, I am getting, I've read some of the books and I've read some of the comics and obviously beaten all the games. Besides Halo 4, I will be getting Halo 4 soon. It's on my list as I get paid. Okay, so I recently bought a uh, Nintendo Game Boy SP, blue. Like I said in my previous videos, I'm getting back in my childhood again, so I had to get an SP. I originally had a silver one, but you know. Anyways, so I got that. And with it, I got Pokemon Blue. Pokemon Red and Pokemon Sapphire version. I love this game. Those games, Pokemon games on the original Game Boy and Game Boy Advance were amazing. And then what came with my SP was an XS Moto. It's like a dirt biking, dirt bike racing game. It's a hype. It's alright. It's not that great. Um, it's actually garbage. I just got it for free, so I was like, whatever. Anyways, guys, um, I also wanted to let you know that I have an Instagram, and my name is Brooke34Williams, so you should follow me. I have a lot of um, pictures of like collectibles and stuff that I have in my room, comics, games, uh, you know, drawings, so uh, check me out on there if you want to, and I'll follow you back, because I love following people's, like, uh, Instagram. I just got my phone, so I'm like crazy over Instagram. So yeah, thanks for watching, and uh, see you later.